Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to make this delicious mole. First, start by cooking your chicken in a pot of boiling water. I'm adding half of an onion, half of a garlic head, salt and pepper to taste, one bay leaf, two tablespoons of better than bouillon chicken base, and for the chicken, I'm using three pieces of skinless chicken thighs, five drumsticks, and three pieces of chicken thighs with the skin, but you can use any type of chicken that you like. For the chiles, you need six chiles ancho, five chiles mulato, two chiles guajillo, and two chiles de arbol. You're going to remove the stem and the seeds except for the chiles de arbol, and you're going to rinse them really well. In a pan, add a little bit of oil and then toast the chiles for about one to two minutes. Make sure to toast the chiles de arbol last and once the chiles are toasted, add two cups of chicken broth. Let the chiles boil for about 8 to 10 minutes and after that add them to the blender. Make sure to also add the chicken broth to the blender. In a different pan, melt lard and start by frying your ingredients. Start with half a cup of raisins, fry them until they puff up. Once that's ready, place them in a bowl of warm water. Then fry one tortilla and as you're frying your ingredients, place them in the blender and also keep adding lard to the pan. Fry half of a white onion. Six garlic cloves. Half a cup of peanuts and half a cup of walnuts, but you can use any type. You can also use almonds. Just make sure that they are unsalted. Fry one platano macho or plantain. And finally, half a cup of animal crackers. Add the raisins to the blender without the water. In a different pan, you are going to toast three cloves, half a teaspoon of anise seeds, half a teaspoon of cumin seeds, half a teaspoon of coriander seeds, and one cinnamon stick broken down. This is going to take about 10 to 20 seconds and then place them in the blender. Toast half a cup of sesame seeds along with half a teaspoon of salt. You are going to place half of this in the blender and save half for garnish.
When you are blending your ingredients, add chicken broth as needed. Add one disc of chocolate ibarra or abuelita. You can do more if you like it sweeter. I did one and a half. In a different pan, melt lard and then add the mole and keep adding broth as needed and make sure to keep stirring so that the mole doesn't get stuck to the pan. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe.